Hey guys, my name's Ben, and welcome to your fifth, sixth, um, uh, driver game development tutorial, and today we're doing about collision. So, we're going to make a box in our game, it's going to be like a side scroll game. So, we're going to make a, a box of sorts, um, uh, at the bottom of the screen, so that the character can fall down onto this box. So, we're going to do public rectangle. Rectang I have problem spelling this word. I'm gonna call it bottom box. And down here, which you're gonna initialize this as soon as the thing is made, we're just gonna tell it what the rectangle is. So rectangle is equal to new rectangle. Oh, I've got to work out the dimensions for it. So um rectangle. Is that spelt right? Yep. Yeah. Uh bottom box. So it's equal to new rectangle and we're gonna make it Zero a dot not a main dot height uh and then we'll make it nine thousand by thirty. See what that looks like. Oh wait, I haven't drawn it yet. So down here we're just gonna draw this out. So g dot fill rectangle and we'll do bottom box dot x bottom box dot y bottom box dot width and bottom box dot height. So that's uh just getting all the variables from up here where it's uh, defining it. So width uh x y width height. So let's save this. Run it. Oh, it's at the top. So if we do minus a dot height. No. Main dot h. Well, I'm just, I'm just gonna work this out. Okay, so it's just zero three fifty nine thousand thirty. So actually, let's change this to set resizable to false. So when we run it, there's a box here at the bottom. We can't resize it, so that's good. So it's making it at zero, so it's close enough to the left as it can be. 350 down, so you can just see the top of it. And it's 9,000 long, so you can see it all across the screen, and then 30 wide. So, we want the character to always be falling until it hits this box. So, what we do is down here in the uh, graphics, we're going to want to do if the character... Or if the bottom box contains the character, we're going to want to invert this. So if the bottom box does not contain the character, then character dot y we're going to want to add to, and that's going to move it down. So it's going to oh ah I see. So it's gone down until it's hit the top. So what we've got to do actually is make some points. Okay, okay, so point point one is equal to a new point and our oh, formula for this will be something weird. One thing I'll be right back, sorry about this, but um This is quite hard to work out and it's easier if I just could do it off camera. Okay, so I think this will work. I think so that's gonna be the bottom left hand corner, I think. I think, I think, just let's hope. So if the bottom box uh, contains point 0.1, so if, actually wait, if it doesn't contain, because that's what we're going to do, we're going to do character dot y plus plus. Let's run this. Yeah, see. And then we can move it along and move it up here, and you see it's sort of glitching down. Uh, or we want to going to probably want to gonna we're probably going to remove that uh those mouse things yeah and and mouse enabled mouse active there we go there we go. 
So we're, we'll keep him in for now. Um. So now, you see, it hits the screen, but on that side it falls off. So we're gonna want to set this to like minus five hundred or something for now. Actually, no, we're gonna keep on zero. I want to make it so that when it hits the side, it doesn't. Hmm. So, so if it's right, we're gonna we're gonna make the character move one to the right. But we only want to do that if um they they haven't hit the right hand side of the screen. So and uh character dot dot x character dot x uh oh wait character dot character dot x dot hmm wait a second this is <sighs> give me a second to put okay so I'm sorry about all these pauses and stuff but if character dot x is not equal to the main dot width so when it gets to no, I think it's stopping just after. So main dot width minus how the character uh width, which is well, was char w. So it hits the side and it stops like that, and then we want to do that for the other side. So and character dot x. It's not equal to zero because zero is that coordinate. So you see, we're stuck here. We're only allowed in this space. We can move up here, but we're not allowed to go past. Uh, oh wait, yeah, we, we are. We will fix that now. That seems like a, it seems like a good enough times any. So when the mouse gets to this place, uh, the new point is here and if the mouse active and character dot x char actor dot x is not equal to main dot width uh minus the char character width then we can't go through there you see as soon as we get to there, it stops us. So, thanks for watching this episode. And next episode, we'll be doing something a bit different. Uh, jumping. So, see you next time. And